Welcome back, Vink Mears, to another KD Gentleman video. I'm David. And I'm Kyle. And we're going to talk to you about breaking down all the new little tips and everything that's coming with the possible new update very soon, Kyle. Yes, we are. I uh, can't wait. Going to be super excited, and I don't think it's far away either. No, so we'll just break into what we think could be coming to this. So the first one I mentioned about last time, Kyle, was a coral wand. And the feedback we got from it was mind blowing. Like people really love it. I don't understand what the hype is. Like I get it, more stuff means more things for people, but we've already got the rock wand, the coral wand. I guess it's just more decoration around the town. Let's make it a coral trident, a weapon, yet also a building thing. Mm -hmm. Maybe, interesting. Maybe, maybe. Uh, another thing that possibly could come in this update, maybe the summer update, a uh, fishing competition. So we got the bug catching one already, but you reckon a fishing competition would be interesting? Uh, it'd be interesting because I know we brought this up with James before and he said fishing can't be done. But that being said, originally bug catching couldn't be done either because NPCs, if you hang out with them, they can't fish and they can't catch bugs. But he's obviously done the programming in it to change that. Yeah, so, and we also asked him on our 12 hour charity stream. He said, nah, can't be done, no way. But he's also said a lot of things can't be done, but they're fi he's finding ways around it. So I reckon he may be just giving us a steer on that one. So we don't try not to ruin the surprise. Speaking of the charity stream, we got to play around with one of the new vehicles that's coming out. Yeah, 100%. So we got to play around with the trucks and they look absolutely amazing. Or the utes, or the, some people call them the pickups. Pick up, pick up truck, ute. Uh, in Australia, we call them utes. They were super fun. Like, reminds me of the old motorbikes when they first came out. Exactly. They were very like slidey around and really fun to control and stuff like that when motorbikes first came out nearly a year ago. Dingle has been out. But yeah, that was, uh, that was really fun to play with. Uh, you can put different colors on it and maybe he was talking about possibly adding a second seat to either the front or the back so you could have multiple people on it. Maybe. I mean, it does have a tray on the back that you can uh, jump into and ride around on. The only issue is that the ute is so high up from the ground that a person can't jump straight into the back. You have to like hop on the front bonnet and then climb into the back for it to work. So maybe there's something we can change where we can get straight into the back of it. Yep, 100%. I would really like to see the more progressing on that, but it was kind of a little buggy to start with, but there's always like time. Obviously, different. it's a work in progress in a game that's an alpha. So, you know, uh, grain of salt, media expectations. Yeah, excellent. So, Kyle, so they did mention uh, in Jose's Dinkum Talks video that there was two new vehicles coming. What do you think the next one could be? We got a U, so what, what's the other, another one you think? Oh. I have no idea what the next vehicle can be. Like, I've thought about it for a while. We've got ground vehicles. We've got, you know, um, flying vehicles. Had a boat in the last update. Had boat in the last update. What about, like, we've got something that goes on land, water, and air at the moment. What about underwater? What about a submarine? Oh, so like a little one-man sub or something. That'd yeah, like cool. a little, like, go underwater. I don't know. It's an idea. Don't forget that stuff like the lawnmower also counts as a vehicle as well. So we could see something as simple as maybe a ride-on mower as a vehicle. I know this is one thing you and I have talking about, a ride-on mower that would cut grass, but not permanently cut it. So you could just get the seeds, like the tractor of grass. So make people's grass farms to get those seeds way easier. What do you reckon on that? Oh, right. Yes. Yeah. So at the moment you create grass farms, but the biggest issue is the manicure process of having to cut down the ones that won't grow the additional seeds. So maybe a device that automatically does that for you would be nice. Yeah. So you've only got like this, the, the site that can do two by three squares. You can do six squares at once, or you run around with a chainsaw in the grass. But if you maybe had a ride on mower that would cut the grass and pick it up automatically, kind of like, like I said, the tractor of grassing, that would be a really cool update. And I reckon that would get a lot of people happy. Maybe even pick up the grass seeds as you go along, like scoop them up. Or uh, yeah. like a, a whipper snipper that does something similar. It doesn't even have to be a ride on. Yeah, for those who don't know whipper snipper, this is like, uh, I believe some people call it a hedge trimmer uh, or an ed edge trimmer. Uh, I believe Americans refer to them as weed whackers. Weed whackers, that's exactly it. Yeah, sorry, weed whackers. So, yeah, weed whackers or in Australia, a whipper snipper. Whipper snipper. <laughs> I love that name, whipper snipper. It, this sounds so, to us, it sounds normal, but if you'd like talk to another person who's like, oh, I got my whipper snipper today, they'd be like, yo, what? <laughs> I've, I'm going to put on my flip flops and go out with my whipper snipper. <laughs> 
Quick interruption guys, if you're liking all the music and sound effects we've used in this video and all our other videos, maybe you should check out Epidemic Sounds. When you sign up to Epidemic Sounds, you get 30 days as a free trial, so you'll be able to find out whether it's for you or not. Epidemic Sounds has over 40,000 tracks to choose from and over 90,000 sound effects to use. No matter what genre you're on you pick, moods, duration, BPM or vocals, Epidemic Sounds has you covered. So maybe you should check out the link in the description down there below, give it a click and start your 30 day free trial with Epidemic Sounds and help support the KD Gentleman channel. Thanks for watching and now back to the video. Um, so another like kind of utilitary, kind of fun thing to have, so you know like we got uh, hang gliders. Not a vehicle, but a vehicle sort of thing. In a yes, way. we've got a few different versions of the hang gliders now, and there's some that are, go pretty far, like the back glider and the new uh, leaf glider. You can get some good hang time on them. Yeah, I wonder if they maybe bring in like something like a zip line. A zip line, okay. So yeah. you would have to build like a tall tail at one end, and then you like zip line down on another end. Something that would have small uses, but it would it'd be fun to use regardless. Mm, okay, yeah, that's an interesting one. I hadn't thought of zip line before. So apart from all that, we have uh, another really big thing that came up recently in uh, Reaps's game, Reaps gaming stream. Uh, roofs. Roofs. Tin roofs. Tin roofs in in a roundabout way that looked like an umbrella. Yes, it it is very reminiscent of the um, the beach umbrella we got in the last winter update, but obviously it's got a texture of corrugated iron, so it appears like a, a traditional Australian tin roof. Yeah, so we've got the images playing on screen now at the moment, so you can see all that, what we're talking about. And if you want, definitely go check out Reaps' channel and uh, see the stream, the yeah. latest stream from like recently. Throw him a like, yeah. tell him we sent you. Tell him Katie sent you. Another thing with that, I reckon, that um, someone mentioned in our comments and whatnot recently is having like a tin tile. So we've got like uh, wood tiles and everything like that you can place down, but what about tin? That'd right, cool. so, so like the corrugated texture of like a tin tile okay yeah so yeah corrugated iron tile texture that'd be cool it'd be interesting uh another quick thing that we've both noted kyle is that um with all the other updates james dropped spoilers here and there and everywhere coming up uh into the update but he does it in a way of like he slowly feeds them to you and then, but when it comes closer to the time, he's like feeding lots of them and it's just coming like, it's it's gonna be here, it's gonna be here. What stage do you think we're up to at the moment with first spoiler to update next week sort of thing? Look, where there's smoke, there's fire. And I think it's starting to come on pretty thick. So I'm, I'm starting to expect at most a month away. So let's say four weeks at closest, maybe two. Yeah, my, my first prediction was somewhere in the, in the in the month of June, which we're in now. So I'm still gonna stick to my guns and say next week, at my guess, Ooh. to the end of the month. So I did say like the first two weeks of June, but I'm sort of going, okay, June is a whole. I'll still stick to June. So next week to like the end of the week. So it's basically between one to three weeks away. If we, my, you're, my say, you're saying one to three, I'm saying two to four. So we're around about the same area. We're yeah. still in that Technically, this will be a winter update for Australia. I know we had a winter update at Christmas, but that's American winter, not Australian winter. So yeah, so it'll be interesting to see this. And like he did mention it in the Thinkum talks with Joe, say that you know he wants to give us a small update to tie us over, kind of like the housewarming was, kind of like what the Christmas update was as well. So just the little updates with extra features and stuff to pull us over until the big update, which is correct which is great this this next update is not the big update it's not summer sun summer sun is coming but it is not this one yeah so summer sun will be another big one or bigger than blooming spring but this won't be it this will be a smaller one but that's all we got for this one guys so if you think you know what is coming in the next update let us know in the comments below if you like this video drop us a like it pushes our content to more people who like income stuff and it will help them find our channel more yeah, definitely, guys. We want to see your speculations in the comments below. So make sure you pop down what you think is going to be in the next update and what you'd like to see. Right. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys.